Hi everyone and welcome back to Tea Time Diaries. Now that it's officially fall, I want to share with you this beautiful fall-inspired tea party that I recently hosted at my home. I will share the food I prepared and the items I used for the tablescape. All linkable items will be linked in the description box. So let's get started with the food prep. Also on the menu for today is a chicken salad and um, I made two because my son is allergic to pecans, so I have a separate one for him. But in order to make this a fall inspired chicken salad, I simply just added cranberries and pecans. Everything, everything else is exactly the same. Um, I've shared how I make the, my plant-based chicken salad in previous videos. So um, every, the recipe is exactly the same. The only thing that's different is that I'm adding pecans and cranberries in order to give it that um, fall uh, feel to it and fall flavors. And then I'm also going to be baking these uh, pumpkin chocolate chunk oatmeal cookies from Trader Joe's um, that, that will be um, part of the desserts for uh, the menu. So these are some of the things that I am uh, putting on the menu for today's fall inspired tea party. And this is what I'm working on so far, but I'll continue to share uh, more of what it is that I'm making as far as the food goes. Hey right, guys, so this is more uh, from the menu. I'm making a split pea soup and then also a pear cake. And I'm just letting it cool down. I'm going to actually make a nice glaze for it that I'll put on top, but I have to let it cool down and I'm in the process of making some scones. Um, so that's basically going to be the menu. The cookies, the cake, the scones, the soup, and the sandwiches. Now that you've seen the menu, here's what the tier trade looked like. I placed my savory fall chicken salad on the bottom, my scones in the middle, and I'll show you how I made these classic scones a bit more fall inspired in a few minutes. And on top of the tier, I placed my pumpkin chocolate cookies. I put the soup in this beautiful pumpkin casserole dish, and I placed the pear cake at the opposite end of the table near the teapot and the tea. To keep with the fall theme, I served this delicious cardamom and cinnamon tea from Republic of Tea. And to jazz up the scones, I used this fig butter from Trader Joe's. The food was delicious, but I absolutely loved the tablescape. I used this buffalo check tablecloth I bought at Hobby Lobby last year and arranged this beautiful sunflower centerpiece with faux flowers that I also purchased from the Hobby Lobby. On either side of the centerpiece, I placed these mini pumpkins that I got at Trader Joe's. These were really cute because they weren't the traditional orange pumpkin color. They were actually yellow and a dark green that almost looks black. So it went perfect with the color scheme. I used my wooden chargers. I've used these plenty of times in previous videos. I also bought these at Hobby Lobby several years ago. I also used my beautiful fall plates. I really love these plates. They are the perfect neutral white, so they match with everything. And the design on them is really lovely. I bought these at Home Goods several years ago, and I don't get tired of them. On each dish, I place these gorgeous sunflower napkins I purchased at Hobby Lobby, and these adorable utensil holders that say, give thanks. I used my old Country Roses teacups and saucers along with these cute wooden spoons from Hobby Lobby with little pumpkins on top. I tied it all together with a pumpkin spice candle for a little bit of ambient lighting and fall aroma, as well as this cute decorative wheelbarrow figure with pumpkins and flowers.
that's all for today's video i thank you for watching if you liked it please comment below and also click on that like button if you haven't subscribed to my channel already i would greatly appreciate it if you did if you are a new subscriber welcome and i just want to wish everyone a happy fall season i hope to be sharing some more fall inspired content as we move forward with the season thank you so much guys for everything have a terrific day bye